biggest, baddest, most awesomest robot. You know, he has one of those in Mario vs. Rabbids. We beat it. It's actually a pretty cool fight. Yeah, what do we got going on here? A surprisingly cinematic view for this game. Yes. Snake hands. The gears. Angry eyebrows, because, you know, needs that. And tank treads, for good measure. The Great King Bowser. Okay, what do we got? Move. He's dual wielding automobiles as weapons. Interesting. Hop right over those. Do I need to ground pound on those? What do we got? We got, we got free eggs falling from the sky. I actually hit here. Hmm. Oh, okay. Ow. I didn't flutter enough. Oh, hey. Hello. Ah, I was wondering if I could, like, hit him more than once. Don't you do it. Don't you die, you did it. I have no eggs. What do we got here? We got a hammer. You gonna hammer me? That thing reminds me of, uh, I have these little, uh, Hot Wheels that you can launch. Whoa, okay, those things, I swear. But yeah, you attach them to something similar to that and then, like, slam it and it forces air at them, and they go flying. Pretty cool. Well, that was pretty cool to 10-year-old me. Oh, hello. That, uh, that does not look healthy. I ain't got an egg to hit him with, so. Got him. And we ground pound for me good measure. Give me help. Help. Coins. Remember, these things don't stop. I thought they would, like, come at me from both sides and smash in the middle. Oh, they go backwards. That's rude. Goes my box. <laughs> don't get hammered on stream. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. Oh no, what do we go? Oh, that's what I thought they were gonna do the first, the last time. I need you. I need you. You go bye bye.
All right, cool. Does he have more than three hits? Oop. Well, I'm not getting full health on this one. I don't think that matters on boss fights. We blew up his robot. He should have asked for the most indestructible robot as well. <laughs> his petulance. What do we got going on here? Ah, phase two. <laughs> Thank you for hosting. Ah, oh, big boy. Oh, is this a throwback to Yoshi's Island where he's off in the distance? You have to throw eggs at him. It is nice. What is... Mega Baby Bowser. <laughs> okay, what's with the... Uh, slot machine? What am I doing? That's a... Terrible angle. Throwing stars coming down. I have no eggs. I don't know how I, oh, well, I, I did get it. I'm supposed to hit that. Oh, I know. I now have it. Okay. Okay, that's quite difficult. Dodge. Oh, hey, it breaks those. That is. Good to know that when you throw them too early. And now I have two. Okay, apparently that's the thing. I should have held on to that. Okay, I now see what... That was... Oddly satisfying. That's a big one. Do not like this camera angle. Oop. We've got him down below half health. It is a little hard to judge the angle on some of these while I'm paying attention to the Big ones. Um, whoa! There was no warning about that. He doesn't get enough height off of those. Oh, he stopped it. But he can't stop the second one. I'm glad that fight ended because I only had one hit left. <laughs>
All right, so apparently we pummeled the magic out of him. Oh, hit the capture device in the middle of the most important cutscene in the game. It's pokiness. Someday, but not today. <laughs> I like to think that Yoshi's ultimate wish with these Dream Star thingies was uh, to bring somebody to the Mushroom Kingdom to do this for them so that they don't have to do it anymore and that that person ended up being Mario. They dreamed of never having to do this again. Pretty cool. And roll credits. Yeah. The Mario and Luigi turn based RPG. Yeah, like they released, um, Bowser's Inside Story remastered, basically, for the 3DS as one of the final 3DS games that they made. I think that's the last time they did that. Because Origami King certainly isn't. I said it before, I don't know if it was on stream or not, what I really, really want is for the Switch Pro, which everybody keeps throwing rumors out that there's, oh, there's going to be a Switch Pro that's got 4K on it, all this other stuff. I don't care about 4K on a Nintendo game. I don't need to see Mario's mustache in ultra high definition. What I want is a Switch Pro that has a 3DS cart slot. Because that suddenly reintroduces all of the DS genre, uh, era games. I mean, you 10, 15 years worth of games added to the Switch instantly. That'll sell a console. And then you can add the 3DS eShop back to the Switch. Or at least the Switch Pro. Yeah, just porting over Inside Story. I don't know how they would do the touchscreen interface for it, other than emulating sort of like a, a Wii U style where you have the handheld switch that sort of wirelessly communicates with the dock. So you have the game playing on your TV screen and you have the switch in your hands. Or they could just release like a, a 3DS handheld peripheral to go with it, like the um, the Joy-Con slide on either side of an extra screen. And you still have your Switch docked, but you're playing with the Joy-Con controller, and the Joy-Con controller has a touch screen in the middle. That's like the second screen. Orange Yoshi right here is totally my soulmate. Just, just soul animal, whatever. Spirit animal, spirit guide, words. 
That would be me. Conked out. Like, if you're flying on an airship, do you get seasick or airsick? Made Splatoon on Wii U. Two screen game. Same with the DS games. Yeah, you know. Splatoon 2 did not receive an. Uh, well, I say Splatoon 2. Mario Maker 2 and a dozen other Switch games, I'm sure, did not receive nearly enough support from uh, Switch Online. They just stopped. Like, hey, you know you love this game and we've thrown a ton of content at you in three months, but now we're done. We're not going to give you any more downloads or updates or patches. We're, we're just done. Hidden Hills. Okay. You know, play Challenges. Let's see what they've done. Where am I? Oh, what do we got? New level. All right. This fast travel. I, I could really use an easier warp system. <laughs> One of many, yes. Play some hide and seek. Oh, no. Unhidden some of the courses, find them and toss an egg. Oh, yeah, more things to hit with an egg. Makes sense. All right, let's zoom out. Two years of Splatfest and we're done. Well, I mean, that's more than Mario Maker got. Mario Maker, it gets the, uh, it's still getting the ninjis. But even those are far and few between. Alright, what does this guy want? The last one was 30. Yellow sign. Only 30? Okay. Can do. I'm guessing, like, each level is gonna have one of these guys that wants, like, 30 or so. Or progressively more. Let's see. Guess I'll just keep going. <laughs> yeah. We need more smiley flowers. Yep. What do we got? Ooh. I would not mind having the uh, Mecha Bowser thing. Or any of the Poochie Pups. The Poochie Pups are adorable. Like... I don't understand Nintendo's uh, reticence to include DLC in AAA titles. They prefer doing, like, uh, piano. Interesting. There's a Poochie. And we got, we can't, eh, whatever. Hey, you know what? Do some more. The rest of the Poochies, I think. But yeah, they prefer to come up with like half of a game and charge full price for it as DLC instead of just actual DLC. Like, new Super Luigi U. Technically, I, I enjoyed it more than Super Mario U. But I would I don't think I would have paid separate for it if it hadn't come with the game. <laughs> 